Hey guys, I'm going to show you the next step in making our pattern paintings. I just have a scrap piece of cardboard here because I'm going to make a template that I can trace, but if you wanted to use scrap paper instead, you could. So I was thinking about uh, doing my Monstera leaf pattern and I was thinking if I'm going to draw multiple leaves, maybe I don't actually want to have to like draw them. Maybe I want to have a template that I can trace. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to sketch out like the basic shape that I want for my Monstera leaves. That way um, I can just cut it out of the cardboard, you know what I mean? I'm just using a white colored pencil, but anything would work. I just thought you guys might be able to see this a little bit better. I'm trying to think of like the basic shape of this kind of tropical plant. Just putting in a loose outline sketch. So I have the shape that I like. Now I'm going to use my scissors to go ahead and cut it out and it's going to create like a template. I always do kind of a rough cut first before I make a nicer cut just because I'm trying to separate it from the cardboard. Wow, I already like the color combination of the brown, white, and black to be honest. I know that this isn't my art, but I kind of like it as a work of art. Now I can go ahead and grab my painting and I can start and looking at my sketch I can kind of see where do I want my things positioned. Looks like I kind of had one going upwards like this and I'm just going to use, you could use a pencil, you could use colored pencil, you could use chalk. I wouldn't use sharpie to trace but you want to use some sort of material um, where you can see your lines. I wonder will you guys be able to see this white or not? Yeah, you can see that. So here's my first leaf. Um, I could do another one kind of going face down, but I like the idea of having, well, let's look at my sketch. I like to have them alternate like um, alternate, what is it called? Directions. Man, whoa, my brain just slowed way the heck down. Does that ever happen to you? Where you're just like, oh, had a thought, but it's gone.
So here's what I've landed on kind of as my final pattern. I'm going to search around just visually and see if there's anywhere that I feel like there's a little bit too much space open, but it seems good. Um, I'm really excited about how this looks actually. And all I did was I just took this same pattern and I just rotated it. Sometimes I flipped it over so that way it was a mirror image. Some places I just included part of it until I was happy with my composition. And this looks so exciting to me.